classified by the authority of the SCP Foundation Overseer Council. This document and all associated documents are the property of the SCP Foundation and are subject to the classification requirements and restrictions therein. This document may or may not contain lethal medic defense measures. Attempting to access or disseminate this document without proper and sufficient authorization is punishable by death. Item number SCP-6349 Security Level 2 Containment Class Euclid Disruption Class Kinnick Risk Class Caution Assigned Site Site 400 Site Director Director Adam Desmond Research Head Dr. Orkin Orville Assigned Task Force Not Applicable Special Containment Procedures Any transmissions transmitting from the planet Venus are to be recorded and analyzed by the Department of Astronomical Research. Any mentions or reports regarding the SCP-6349 transmissions by other non-Foundation organizations, including the UNUSA, United Nations Office for Outer Space Affairs, are to be tracked down and deleted by Foundation web caller xshaft.aic with all physical evidence confiscated and removed by embedded Foundation agents. Description SCP-6349 is the designation given to the series of anomalous audio message transmissions that were primarily received through the use of Foundation Orbital Satellite Cypher-282. Triangulation attempts of the SCP-6349 transmissions have revealed that they were originally sent from the planet Venus. The following is a log of all known recorded messages of each SCP-6349 transmission. Sister, sister, can you hear me? I see you, but I can't hear you, sister. It's been so long, sister. I've missed you. I... My God, sister, what have they done to you? What happened to your beauty? Has it been stolen from you, sister? Can you hear me, sister? What have they done to you? Please answer me, sister. Is this their doing? Have they done this to you? Your face, sister, is not what I used to be. Please answer me. If this is their doing, sister, I swear to you, I will make them suffer. I promise they will never hurt you again. Please answer, sister. I am worried of you. I truly am. It is them, isn't it? They did this to you. I promise you, they will suffer. Addendum 6349-1 Incident Log On March 24th, 2016, Foundation Astronomic Probe Fargo 2512 reported that multiple large appendage-like protrusions composed entirely out of iron have emerged from the surface of Venus. According to the scanners aboard Fargo 2512, these protrusions were around 3.5 kilometers in height and possess a width of around 50 meters. At the same time, Multiple Foundation orbital scanners reported that Venus has somehow detached itself from its natural solar orbit and was currently heading towards Earth. The Overseer Council declared the situation as in Stage 6 Elk Class global threat and immediate preparations were made accordingly. However, 30 minutes into the event, Foundation Satellite Watchtower Godel 32, located in Northern Ireland, received a transmission originating from Earth, the exact source of which is currently unknown. The message was heavily encrypted, but Foundation cipherers were able to properly decipher the contents of the message, which reads the following. Stop, please. I don't need help from you now, and I won't need it ever again. I really need some space right now, and you getting worked up over me is not helping. And if you generally want to know, yes, it is them, but I honestly don't hate them for it. Most of them are not that bad, I swear. You don't need to worry about anything. Just 
Leave me alone, okay? I mean, please, don't take this the wrong way. I know you mean well. I truly do. It's just that your way's just so backwards. Following the Foundation receiving the message, the orbital scanners we put it at Venus has halted its path towards Earth and had somehow reattached itself to its own solar orbit. Fargo 2512 reported that the protrusions on the surface of Venus have now decreased in size. Due to this, the Council declared that the threat has been prevented. Investigation into this event is still ongoing.